So how does it feel? <laughs> you like the most famous person in Chicago. Don't so how start. does it feel? Don't I can't start, start that? Why? You don't think you're famous? Don't start. You're famous, man. It's too early for this shit. Famous. Man, come on. What's up? What you? 15. Because I don't. Why don't you feel famous? Stop asking me dumb <laughs> questions. Next question, please. Okay. Are you counting? 12. Shut up. 13. 14. 15. Yes, I'm counting. When was the last time you did an interview? Have you done an interview before? Yes, I've done plenty of interviews. I'm time? famous, remember? You are. You're really famous. Like, you say tip. You, everybody knows who you are. <laughs> Please shut up. <laughs> it is too early so for this. So what do we call you, Tip? Like, what, what is your title? Like, if I'm a trainer, what do they call you? What, 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 what would you like to be known as? Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur? Yeah. Tell everybody what and you got, let man. me let me say this. I'm a Instagram really? model. Are you? Of course. Is that what you consider yourself, though? No, I don't at all. Okay. But, you know, I kind of run with it. Sometimes it helps. Yeah. And it hurts, too. Where, where does it hurt? Oh, my God. I feel like I'm in a therapy session right there now. There you go. I like it. At least Let me do the next set. Go ahead. <laughs> I hope you count, because I'm not. <sighs> so how does being a famous Instagram model hurt your, hurt your image? Hurt your... Hurt your well, clearly, I'm single. Are you now? Of course. Really? Yeah. Okay. Why is that? Why is somebody of your stature single? Go ahead, tell them, because you hate men. Go ahead, tell, them, tell <laughs> us why. I'm not going to do this with you. <laughs> I am not going to do this with you. Why not? <laughs> I don't think I found a secure man. Okay, so what does that look like? What does a secure man look like? A secure man. Come on now. You know okay. what I'm saying. No, for real, because everybody has a different definition. Like, I just like. feel like men I've dealt with are insecure with the tiny fame I do have uh -huh. and can't handle, I guess they feel like I'm accessible. Are you? I don't think so. Okay. But it's a stereotype, like. Instagram model with so and so many followers. Right. All these famous rich guys are trying her left and right. Are they, which are they, they are. are. All right, I would say, are they not which the OGM? Right, right. So, how do so, you. Okay, so my question is Secure Man obviously cannot be insecure or threatened by whoever tries to talk to you, right? Because, yeah, we, because I feel like if you fuck with somebody and they know that, then they should be secure and trust you. But how much reassurance do you give that person? Or Baby. how much do you feel like you need to? Baby. I have done over and beyond. Yeah, and I'm make... just not doing that shit no more. Okay. It never like works in my favor. Favor. Oh. True. Like, I don't know. I keep coming out with the short end of the stick. I think. Okay. It is what it is. That's I'm focused right now. There just want to make my money. There you go. Focus on my kids. Control. Push yourself up. You're fine. Come on, man. Ten. Two more. Up. One more. All the way up. Good job. Step up. Good job. Uh, tell Bro, tell us I'm how you started your, your boutique. I barely can breathe. I think this is a bad idea. What? To be trying to talk. <laughs> and work out well working out yeah it's fun but it's cool well to answer your question uh -huh. i started my business basically during COVID. okay like i was doing the workout stuff the women's workout wear uh -huh. it was kind of hard i ain't gonna lie what makes it hard um the market or just like yeah marketing and I was doing wholesale, so I believe it's kind of hard actually finding like nice looking, decent, Pieces. stylish workout wear. Everything was kind of basic and simple. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So I started, I was like, fuck it. Like, I've been wearing all these people's clothes all these years, exactly. modeling for them, making them money. I'm like, why not? Right. I just ordered dead ass. I ordered like six outfits. 
like this. Took pictures in my living room, so quick as hell. Just online, no like website right. though. It was just mm -hmm. like through Cash App and Zelle. Right. And then it went from there. And I came over with French Kiss, cause I used to like, um, basically I love Paris and it was just like a whole Paris floral mm -hmm. love type of thing. And I went from there. Now what did, didn't you expect in business? Oh, oh my God. Say. Well, let's do this first before you. I didn't expect. Relax, I got you. We'll answer that. No, no, no. I'll answer that right now. <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> what didn't you expect going into I business? I didn't expect for so many people right, to not want to help me. Boy, no, don't struggle now. Come on. I'm not struggling. Come on. Come on. Come on. Six, uh, six more. I didn't expect people to act like, and I mean, like people that I was close to, uh -huh. or people I know that sell clothes and was in that retail it was acting funny like nobody wanted me to do it so like initial shit like easy simple shit like shipping wholesale retailers like just getting basic information i did all this shit on my own but do you feel like you're supposed to or do you feel like because I mean, you got relations with these people they should help you now i feel like just do shit on your own. Figure it out. Right. But back then, I probably, I did feel like, wow, like, you know, this is my friend. I modeled for her company, her company, her company. And, like, damn, y'all can't help me with a simple, you know? I mean, but I think it's, I wouldn't, I wouldn't say it's fair enough, but people know. It is fair now. That's how I feel. You but, it, right? you know, I mean, because you when have you the first start, you just overwhelm. And I'm not going to lie, like, a lot of things were handed to me in different scenarios so i kind of just felt like oh shit i gotta do this shit on my own mm. I mean, you're gonna use <laughs> your pretty privilege until it don't work i obviously. don't have pretty privilege who don't let me tell you something okay listen 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 we, that we, shit we is not... a gift and a curse right but it's not i'm but... telling you people fuck with you because you're pretty yeah and people won't fuck with you because you're pretty okay you know how many you know how many events and women um you know the whole little Support my business, support black business, women this, oh, tea party this, this is, I don't get invited to that shit. Why? Why do you feel like you don't? I feel like some people don't want me in a room and Why? that's just the truth. Okay, but that's, it, yeah, but is that because of your looks? Yes. Why? I don't know. That doesn't I'm, make sense. I just, make sense. It does make perfect sense. Okay, how? It makes perfect sense so because it's called what, jealousy. What are people jealous it's of? It's called, when you find out, you let me know, cause up to this day, you still don't know I why. still wonder why certain people don't like me. I'm not, I've done nothing to you, okay, at all. So you feel like it's just your persona online or what people may. It's think a lot about of things, you. yeah. And then you know, gossip, of course, yeah, and for sure. the hate train. No, true, true. Pick up another one. I think people kind of tend to believe what they hear instead of getting to know me. I mean, but and but that, and most that, times when I say when I meet new people. I dead ass, like dead ass. The first thing people say, like, damn, I didn't know you was like this nice. I didn't know you was this goofy. But, but, I would have never thought that, you know, like thank but, you for helping me. Right, but because of things I hear from people that don't. But you're not accessible, like as much as you think you are. Like, or as much as I mean, people make how you accessible do you think I should be? But I'm saying that's like, why people develop their own persona of you or their own perspective of you because they don't get to talk to you. Nor do you talk either. I do talk. Where? I talk a lot. When? People Where? that know me. Exactly. But <laughs> we talking about like the, the masses of social media, you don't speak too much. Right. So that's what I'm saying. So if, I, if you're not I accessible. I think when I say, when I'm, when I'm talking about this issue, I'm yeah. more so talking about Chicago. Yeah, but how many like people, you know? Yeah, but how many people see you in Chicago? A they lot might of people see, see me in Chicago. They'll see you around, <laughs> but how many people are actually going to talk to you? Nobody's coming to up to you like, hey, say la da da like. A lot of people do. Believe it or what? not, they do. Just hey, introduce themselves, or like, oh, it's is nice it a to long meet you. Right? Is it a long conversation? Or is yeah, it sometimes high... it okay. just it just depends on the situation, the mm -hmm. environment. Okay. But I also, just I don't know. Maybe it might be like an insecurity I have too. Sometimes okay. I won't overextend myself because I already feel like I get the looks and the the vibe. Be kind of like, mm. what do you mean? Like, for example, but how is that an insecurity of yours? Though? Because, for example, if I walk in a room, everyone could be staring. For sure. But I'm also not the type that's going to go around and be like, hey, 
How you doing? My name's Tiffany to wow. every single person. I've done it. And, is, is that a respect and, thing? Or? Yeah, it is respect. Right. I'm respectful. I'm saying like in like an event type of space. Okay. I'm not saying if I walk into a home and it's Thanksgiving, yeah, 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 like yeah. that's different. Yeah. But I've done that and I have I have gotten people to come back and say certain things to my friends like, oh, she was staying offish or she was... She wasn't that nice, or it's just like. But so, but okay, but why? I don't do you, know. I don't know what. But why do you care? Though? Like I don't know, because I feel like I don't be like that. Like I feel like I'm nope, right. So I feel like if I'm introducing myself and I'm talking to you and we're having a conversation, sometimes I'm I'm trying to go over and beyond and be nicer or just to have a certain type of tone, and that shit is kind of frustrating. So is that like you people pleasing though? Exactly. And I don't, I'm not, that is not me. You know what I'm saying? So why do you try to make it you then instead of just... Because sometimes I be wanting people to understand, like, what they hear is not what I am. So I try to, like, I try to show people my personality and my character, why like, directly. You, but sometimes they take it a whole nother way. And I just like, you know what? Fuck it. Like, you know, like, if I do, I don't. Like, I just... But that's what I'm saying. So it's a fuck it, like... Because either way, if you're too nice to somebody, it's a problem. Exactly. And then I'd be too nice. And then I have people around me like, you're too nice. And then I'd be too nice. And certain shit has happened to me that a lot of people don't even know. Right. Like from friends, like people that I'm not cool with no more. I've right. done certain shit. Right. And it's like, I never really tell my story. Like people don't give my version of the story. But that's because you don't but tell nobody it either, though. Because... But not, not saying that everybody, <laughs> like people you talk to, obviously. Right. But, if I literally, I but, if I literally defended every fucking thing someone said about me, I would be, I would be fucking just worn the fuck out. Like right. I can't, I can't sit here and follow up after every fucking thing somebody say. Like but, it but, is what but it does, is. But does it bother you though? Yeah, it bothers me sometimes. Why? I don't know. Cause I'm a fucking human. Come on, man. Let's go. <laughs> I don't know. I know why. It's just, do you know why? Okay, so why do you think why? I mean, again, you came down to you people pleasing, but then, I mean, it depends on, at a younger age, who did you need to please? Like, we can go all the way back to childhood. Okay, we we're not doing it. therapy okay. right now. <laughs> <laughs> 12. Yeah. Step. yeah, we'll do one more. Yeah, but does that come from you, like, high school? Like, how long have you been, like, this version of yourself? Have you been like this forever? Or, like, what is... Again, like, I can tell, like, people can glow up, like, obviously in high school... I feel like my personality is the same, but you get better. You're more successful. Like I've always happen. been picked on. And that's how I feel like I'm still being picked on. Yeah, it makes sense. And I'm not trying to play the victim because I did my shit too. But uh -huh. I also feel like people do pick on me. Okay. But my skin way stronger than it was in high school. Like, mm. It don't bother me. It only bothers me when it, I feel like it can affect my business uh, okay. or affect my network. You know, oh, like networking with some people, like some people won't even try to fuck with me just off the strength of something someone else said. Right. They don't know if it's true or not. Right. It's so just want, with me, I feel like but people will believe the worst of a sentence. You can say one sentence about me. People going to take the the most negative word and run with that. I mean, but that's everybody in general, though. That's not. Well, I mean, it could be. I mean, yeah, I mean you, you're not singled out. But the only reason, like I said, like. I feel like it just bothers me more when it affects business or when it affects that happen relationships or situations. Hell yeah. Of course. You know how many times I come across, like, you know, when people order, I have names, addresses, everything, like, you know, okay. to ship out. I see certain names and it'll be like a family member or a cousin of a certain, a certain person. Like, you don't like me that much that you'll send someone else to order something from me. Like, Oh, so you feel like they like, don't want to be seen of actually supporting you? Yeah, and then like I feel like a lot of people don't fuck with me just off the strength of not wanting to let other people know they fuck with me. Hmm. That's crazy, right? But again, nobody like knows. I do what I want to do. Like I, if I like somebody, I'm gonna fuck with them. I don't care. What? Like you know. No, I'm with you. But not it's crazy. But not everybody's gonna move like you. They're not, not everybody's gonna be have your heart. But like I'm saying, it doesn't hurt my feelings. I'm not boohoo crying about it. Yeah, obviously. But it just pisses me off when I'm trying to network trying to become a better businesswoman trying to meet new people run in different circles i mean but is that hard because of the circles you ran in before and all uh, the perception fucking course 100 percent. 
but I understand that too. So I'm, but again, I'm I mean, working at it. Like you know, I've been detaching all year. It is what it is. You see yourself talking more, not even telling like that part of your life, just more of letting people in on like you. I'm being working an on it. I've been on podcasts before. People just probably missed it, and I might not have just you know crazy promoted it, but right. I've done right, because that's what I'm telling you. Like, I've done I, certain I, shit. Because, again, before me, actually, I think I've ran into you two or three times, right? Highs, whatever. But I've never had a conversation with you until this. But We ran into each other in what? The club? Right. But exactly. That's, but that's why it was only two or three times. Because right. I'm, you're there where I'm not. Like, it's just different spaces, right? But it's the thing where it's like, of course, people are going to talk about you. But it's the thing of, like... Is it going, does it affect me bringing you in here? No, because I don't really care. But I, I'm the person, I but, I, but, it, but I'm bold enough to ask you what I feel like I've ever always heard about you. Now, is it my business? Hell no. But am I nosy? For sure. Why are you but, nosy? Because I want to Because everyone is nosy. Bottom line, shit just be hard, but. But that's life though. I think that people, like, they feel like, oh, I'm pretty. I have everything easy. But I really don't. But remember. That shit, I'm telling you, it's a gift and a curse. Like, oh, I'm pretty, so I got this job or, you know, this promotion or I got this for free or this. But literally, you know, I was pretty before and I got fired from a job, from a woman, because the manager, which was a man, liked, you. liked me. And I got fired just for that. Yeah. I got fired from like three jobs in my life. That's why I'm like, I'm not working for nobody else because of that, because I'm pretty. Yeah, but would you rather be pretty or ugly? Like you, it's like saying you want to have rich people problems or broke people problems, you know? No, I'd rather be pretty. Don't get me wrong. Exactly, <laughs> hey, So take what remember, like when they say, when you pray for rain, you gotta deal with the mud, right? I so, do, but that shit don't. It, you gotta be a gangster mentally. I am. You gotta, you gotta be no, a gangster. for real. I am. I believe. It. I am. I believe. Like I said, I'm new to the whole entrepreneur world. Like three years, literally three years. Like I, I had other businesses, like the bottle babes. The, yeah. The modeling agency, all that stuff, that was cool and all, but this was like something I had on my own completely. I did bottom up, like nobody gave me shit for this, and I made sure of it because I didn't want no one to say, like, oh, I did this for her, or you know. Let's see. Come on. Mm. Come on. What number? Nine. Up. Uh. Fucking underarms hurt. Oh, my Lord. <laughs> This is gonna hurt my back. You got some money. I didn't even know Gucci had. Look at that. You got money. These old. That's it don't a, matter. That's the only reason why I wear them to the gym. They fucked up. 15. Oh my. Shut up. God. Come on, man. I'm waiting for you to say something stupid. I'm waiting for it. Oh my God. Shut up. I wish I could do that shit Sierra be doing when she go all the way. Go ahead, go ahead. Hurt yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Broke back your ass. Come on, man. Come on. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, Tiff no. work out, but she ain't really lift weights. I ain't used to it. It's Bro, like, oh, I've been lifting weights. You ain't fucking lifting Save it. You would nice not content. disrespect my other trainers like that. <laughs> I, well, I'm not. Yeah, yeah, not, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. okay. These little ass weights you be lifting. Tiff used to threes and fives. It's okay. Mm, shut <laughs> up. <laughs> we get to 15s. Yeah, come on now, big dog. You actually got to work. Come on. But what do you feel about body enhancements? What do you feel? You I'm all about for it. Do what you got to do, girl. There you go. What, what, what's, what's your opinion? Give me more. I'm just saying we all have insecurities. And why not fix them if you can do it? Okay. I feel but, like the people that so, drag so, body enhancements are uh -huh. people, one, who can't afford it? Who can't afford it? Okay. I'm just gonna say that, and I'm not no oh rich bitch y'all broke type shit. No, I'm just saying. No, 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 no not, not at all, right? Not at I all. know, but you know how people like you say one little comment about, <laughs> you know, I'm people not like can't that. Afford I don't but, count but, but, people but money. Do you feel like is, do you feel like doing that is going to an extreme to change no. an insecurity? Okay. No. Okay. But you know what I think too. Huh. I think people have this. Like, I think people think that women, I'm gonna say we, because I had enhancements too, that we do it for men. Like, you know, okay. like we do it for 
them. Like, I don't think that's the case. Why is that? I mean, I'm going to speak for myself, okay. of course. But I had insecurities after I had my son. I did things I wanted to do for my body to make me feel better. Okay. And I do. I don't care what people say about it. Go ahead, keep on. Three. I met so many women, even women that come in my store. Yeah. All ages, like literally. Yeah. I met a 50 year old woman that just came in with a whole full body, ass, yeah. titties, everything done. And she was happy as hell. So, but do you like, feel. Like, do what you gotta do. Right, but do you feel like your confidence has to come from how you look? Or do you I don't feel think like, so. Or do you feel like. Women... I don't think so because I'm confident as hell. Right. And a lot of people compliment me on that. Like, I could walk into a room and a person literally would say, Damn, your confidence is crazy. But it's like, I can see it, oh. you know? So where does your confidence come from? Because, like, which, again... It's just something it. I that's gain. It. Like, I didn't have it, it always. Hey. Like... Right, so, but, that, right, that's my thing, right, is... It's most, just something that came with time. And just getting to know yourself and loving yourself. Okay, do you think people try to buy confidence, right? Like, so if you if they need enhancements, so it's like... I'm yeah, just people do. But okay. I don't want to speak for yeah. people. I want to speak for people that I've met or I know. Right. I'm not gonna speak for everyone. I'm not gonna give out names, but yeah, I know yeah. a lot of people that have body enhancements. Right. But I also know deep secrets and deep insecurities that you wouldn't even think a person have. Like right. down to like, oh my neck is fat. I'm like, what? But that's what I'm saying. So is it is that something they need to fix first before just trying to automatically get lipo on their neck or something, right? Like because again I don't think that you should buy confidence, and if you feel like you have to buy a body to have confidence, maybe you should hold out on that and kind of work on your insecurities inside. But how many people are really truly going to do that before they actually go get it? I don't know. See, that's and that's the thing, right? But I, 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 I always been confident, like even. But I think I had to be confident, like you know, I had to be more secure in myself because, like I said, I've been picked on since high school. Yeah. Like I used to have bitches waiting outside. Like, I'm gonna beat your ass when I get out. I'm like, why you don't like me? I, called a bitch before in high school like why you don't like me and what she said i don't know i just don't fucking like you so did you did she beat you up no she wasn't oh. outside of course oh, okay. honestly any <laughs> <laughs> any person that ever has told me on site i guess i've never seen them yeah. no what do you think people want to know about me People definitely want to know your story of how you became to be. People definitely want to know your personality. Because again, you're one of them people who I see in my view. You're like a, you're like a Chicago Lori Harvey. Oh, it's not the bad thing. Like that's like see that. I take like, I take the bad. It's not it's not right. But that's the thing where it's like if I don't know you, we don't Lori don't speak too much either. Yeah, I take we, the bad. We know she we know she looks a certain way. We know she only, in our head, she only fuck with a certain type of caliber woman, and then she makes some money. First of all, Listen, what? okay, relax, that's what I want people relax, to know relax, about relax, me, okay? Relax, relax, relax. No, 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 Look at no, no, you, no, no. see, calm down. <laughs> you asked me a question, I'm just giving you an answer. Okay, keep going, I'll okay. let you finish talking. Thank you, because you've been cutting me out, but I've been, you know, I'd be respectful. No, I mean, I think if you ask me what people want to know about you, I think that's that's what it is. But if I think we perceive you, Nobody knows. Like, truly, you're a mystery unless you've been in the circles with you, right? Right. I don't know shit about right. People telling my business. Exactly, they do. right? <laughs> but then that goes to the question of who do you keep around you to tell exactly. your business? Exactly. Right? So. Oh, baby, you ain't got to tell me. All right. But at the same time, that's what... This year has been a fucking year. I'm just going to say that. Is that a good thing? I've learned so much about people who have literally been around me for 10 plus years. Yeah. Really don't even like me. Yeah. Like, this shit is crazy. Yeah. I mean, you're about 45 now, so. Bitch. Let me stop. Bitch. <laughs> Make sure you put that in the video. <laughs> bitch. <laughs> Quit fucking playing with me. <laughs> Tip like 47, y'all. She does look like she's 28. It's I'm okay. actually 35, if there everyone wants to know. November what? What birthday? November 11th or 12th? 13th. 10th. Oh, 13th. Oh, Scorpio. Okay. Relax. You don't do too much. So how does that make you feel that people are not your friend that you thought you were your friend for so long? You know what people perceiving me, they think I'm heartless. Like 
I'm this strong bitch that get through shit and go through shit. Lose but you gotta friends. be right. The world but is, I am kind of. I am for but real. The world, the world has taught you to be that way. Because, exactly. Right. Like I mean, I'm with you because. But I'm like everyone else. That shit be hurting my feelings. Like you know, like shit hurt my feelings just like everyone else. Okay. But I think maybe because I don't show it. There you go. You come off emotionless, you know, you come off heartless, you come off Bro, cold. if people really knew, like, my story from beginning to end, like, you know how I always go back to childhood, right? I always go back. Right. If people really knew, knew. What you had to go through? Please. They can, they can, they can walk in your shoes? Just. I'm just saying, I've had it, okay? I mean, I believe you. Anything me. that you think could have happened to a person uh -huh. or a child... Have you healed from it? No, so, I did as I've been in therapy. I okay. I do therapy. Like there you go, you know, my man. There you go. Like I have, but we were just speaking on like friendships and like some shit. I think I do just be like, all right, fuck it. Let me just keep it moving. Right. But I'm that person. Like I take a day. Like I stay in the house. I cry. I do whatever I got to do, and then I get up and just like you know what? Let me go to the gym. Let me go do this. Let me just keep busy. <sighs> my underarms hurt. Up. Control. Stop just trying to get through it. Three. I'm done. <laughs>